I got my debit card information stolen last year. Is that been anyone here? Yeah, it's the worst. I want to tell these internet thieves, it's like, you're messing with the wrong guy. Because, like, I don't have enough money to not notice. <laughs> like, my bank called me, they're like, did you spend $120 on? I was like, let me stop you right there. I have never gone triple digits. So. Unless they raise the price of another way, I have no idea what that would be. But I had this thought, I got my debit card information stolen, and I was like, you know what? At least in the old days, if someone robbed you, they had to look you in the eye. I had that thought, and then like a week later, I got mugged. I was like, no, no, internet is better. <laughs> Let's do it that way from now on. <laughs> I got my, I got my, uh, I got my, this guy, uh, I was walking home, it was like three in the morning. This guy punched me in the face, grabbed my phone, and ran away. Which was a bummer, because I was hoping uh, nobody would do that. <laughs> so that was a bummer. <laughs> It was crazy because it was the night of the Mayweather-McGregor boxing match. So I like, planned my night around this pay-per-view of two guys punch each other in the face. <laughs> and then on the way home, just got it for free in 3D. <laughs> because it happened the night of that boxing match, I kept picturing that like famous boxing announcer like narrating my mugging. You know, just being like, and in this corner, weighing in at somewhere around 190 pounds, he hopes it's not 200, but he's afraid to check. <laughs> the Irish victim. <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> I didn't even say anything cool. That was like my biggest problem with when I got mugged. I wish I said something cool, you know? Like I wish when he came up and started to punch me, I was like, wait, 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 sir. I have a family to be supported by. <laughs> Or if like when he took my phone and started to run, I was like, looks like he switched to sprint. <laughs> I just spend a full week without a phone in New York City. <laughs> you feel like an insane person. I was walking around like Ebenezer Scrooge just grabbing boys, like, what day is it? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> it was great. When you get your phone stolen, people say this, they go, well, you know, it's actually better to get your phone stolen than to get your wallet stolen. And those people have never tried to watch porn on a wallet. <laughs> Can't do it.